your money. Honeymoon with your bitch out in Nantucket. 30 racks down like fuck it. Hey, gravy my splash like a bucket. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's hold complicated, hold on, hold on, hold on. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Welcome to the Marsh Pit. What's Things on, might get a little bit crazy, might get a little bit spicy. Hey, Nengage. Clamps. Hey, the Eagles are in the Super Bowl. Eagles are in the Super Bowl. I don't watch football. Sadly. No, that's okay. So I can't keep up with it. Super Bowl party in my house. For real? Yeah. I'm down. When? It'll be a Sunday. It's on a Sunday. Two weeks from now. What time? It's late. Like, usually 7 30, 8 o'clock. Mm, I might have to request off then. I'm going to request off. Or I'm going to be like, I can work during the day, but I'm not working at night. I will leave and quit. I'll be like, listen, I'll come in earlier. Because I normally work till day 30. I usually work. I get there 10. late. I get there well, late. Well, actually, on Sundays, I work like 3 to 10. I get there late. I can get there early. I can just start at 12 and work to. No, I'm like saying, like, if you're going to have a party, I can just show up late. Yeah, I mean. It starts at 8 o'clock. I'll just look it up, dude. Something like that. So, how. All right, so tell me the situation on your, um, on your work. Because I thought you got work. fired. Maybe. Not fired, but. You thought I was about to quit? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was great. All right. So. What was it? Oh, they got mad at me. Because when we had all that snow that. and stuff, yeah, I didn't come in and they got mm-hmm. mad because my mom didn't want me driving in the snow. Mm-hmm. So. Wait, I'll, it's this Sunday? No, not this Sunday. Oh, yes. No, Sunday sir. the 4th. That's two Sundays oh, today's from now. Tuesday. Oh, all right, keep going. And like, anyways, I went into work the next time I went in, which was a few days later. I had like almost a whole week off. And uh, I was thinking everybody was going to be mad at me because the way they were talking to me on the phone and stuff. Were they? No, it was actually great. Like, they didn't need, they were just laughing and stuff. They didn't care they're at laughing all. Laughing at you or they No, just laughing at the whole situation, really. And they're like, I don't I, know like, They could tell I was, like, genuinely, like, worried about it because mm-hmm. I want them to like me or whatever. And uh, I looked at the schedule and they only had me working, like, they come hours and half, basically. And that's what I wanted. I was like, I was thinking they were gonna work me to death again, because I made them. Well, mad why can't you tell? Them why can't you tell them to not? Why can't you? You should be able to say like, "Hey, I want to work this amount of hours. Can I get this? If you're working That's too much, I be like, "Hey, That's what I'm I working did. way too many hours. I can't." I do did. This. I said I was working too much, and then said I only wanted like twenty to twenty-five hours a week, and now I'm working like seventeen or eighteen a week, which is fine. I'm only working three days a week. That's what I want, though. Yeah, I can't request stuff for. Um, that so I'll just have to kind of, it's like there's a deadline so like they oh. schedule they schedule two weeks in advance tell me you can get over it no I'll just be like hey these, I'll text him he'll I'm probably sure. let me I'll just turn the shift to somebody okay so you got a ting you got a ting we're, we're on this again Oh, I was like, no way, it's already 11. It's only 10.45. That clock's fast, though. That's it? Because oh, it's not, yeah, it's 45. It's 45, oh. you didn't finish it, right? Do you? Do you have a, do you got anything going on? I don't have no ting. Do you have a ting? No, sir. I want to hear about your, your ting. No, we're not going to talk about this. We're not going to talk about that ting? We're not going to talk about, talk about this. Podcast. I don't no, want to talk about this. No, sir. No, it's good. So why don't you have a ting? No, no, we're not going to talk about this on the podcast. No. There's no point. None of them want to hear that. I can... Oh, I was thinking about this in my head at Kroger. I was like, all right, this can go somewhere. And I had a reason why I don't have a ting. But now I think about it. No, I do have a reason. It's way too much work. <laughs> way too much work. <laughs> right? One, it's too much work. Two, man's is broke. He's still in, man's is in debt, 16 years old, in debt, all right? I have to pay my dues first. Third, are you going to prom? Huh? See, I hope so. That's, That's a, a uh, sore subject. That's what I'm working on. That's what I'm working on. You know Noah's not going to prom? No, of course he's not. Are you going? <laughs> I don't know. There's a lot of factors that play into it. See, I'm not going unless I have... Unless I have somebody to go with. I don't have to have a date to go. I do. I'm not not going. I don't have to have a date to go. Because I don't like dances like that. What do you mean? Like, I don't like dances. You went to, um, you went to, what's it called like that? Homecoming? Yeah. I had a date. It was super, super last second, though. Like, it wasn't a date. It was like, I'm going to meet up with you or whatever. 
I can't go alone. Why? You what? can go with friends. Cause I have, I'm in that weird friend group, Max. Like I'm not friends. Okay, with, no, but with it's that not, group, no, it's not, not, no, 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 no. Here's the way I look at it. All right. That means you can go with anyone you want to. I know, but literally that's anyone. Weird. Literally anyone. Because I feel weird. weird in either group. That's not okay. Because I feel like I'm not as cool as these people. But I'm cooler than. I'm not these cooler than these people. people but like, like uh, no, but yeah. I just I can't relate with these people either. But you can halfway relate. Yeah, I can halfway relate on both sides. That's why I like this middle that I'm in. I think everyone knows who we're talking about. Oh, everybody that's watching this knows. Like everybody from here that's watching this knows. Well, knows the two groups. Yeah, they know the two groups. I don't want to say we're cool in them because that's mean, but like. <laughs> no, I don't mean it like that. Cause I already, like, already said that. No, I didn't mean it like that. I'm not like, cooler than them, but like I can't like. I what relate. they talk about. Well, they what relate. they talk about is not relate. what I want to talk about. Exactly. You can't grind. Just like what they talk about is not what I want to talk about either. All right, so Grace Bush, we're sitting here in entrepreneurship. There's a PowerPoint, okay? And then there's a book. The book has 30 pages, all right? Where the PowerPoint has all the focus notes that you need to take. She's like, oh my gosh, I have to go through 30 pages of this. Oh my God, this is crazy. And I'm like, isn't there a PowerPoint up? Caroline's like, yeah, there's a PowerPoint. And then um, and she's like, oh, I'll just do five pages of this. I'm like, why? There's a PowerPoint right there for you. Literally focus. Literally focus. Literally focus. Look She's at like, the I feel bad if I don't do the book. I'm like, literally half of that book is bullcrap. You crap. know what kills me? Bullcrap. The way I do my work, and I still end up with like the same grades as she does, and she gets heated because she puts in so much time and effort See, and stress. I don't into get things. the same grades, but I'm passing. Like, like she may get an A, but I'll get a B in math, right? I won't do my homework till like a day after it's due. We have homework that she did. She assign that that Thursday. Six point two is supposed to be due tomorrow. It's not due tomorrow. I'm not due, but you're supposed it's to have supposed it like to be done. I don't know. That's what what problems are, I don't know what problems we're supposed to do because I missed that Thursday you don't and know the what Wednesday. To do? I have no oh, idea what problems. Snap. I don't think I do either. It's I'm fine. not stressing it's about fine. it, but that's the thing. Like I don't care. Like they. Like, we don't even them. know. Yeah, we don't even know. And I'm gonna turn it in. I told in. Grace today, I was like, you have way too much stress. I'm gonna life. turn it in a day late, and I guarantee you, I still do the same on the quiz, and I guarantee you, I still get the same grade on my homework as you do. And like, and even if you don't, you're still coming out passing. Exactly. You're still coming out with a I good had the grade. highest final grade in the like on the midterm. Did you really? Yeah, that's why I got 100. Oh, well, is she in your class? Yeah. I didn't know she was in class. I got stats. the highest out of everybody. It was on a curve. That's why you got the four point bump, because I got a 96. Cause you got ninety six. Yeah, nobody else got nothing that high. Wait, isn't it? Um, how does the curve work? The highest subtracted from one hundred. Well, the way our teachers do it, it's the highest grade gets bumped to a hundred, and then however many points that grade went up is what everybody else goes up. But an actual curve, it's supposed to be like top gets a hundred, top twenty five get an A, um, middle get a B and C. Let's get a B or something, something like that. I mean, that system kind so, of works, right? You know what I'm ready for? What? That pizza. That pizza. Yeah. So what's gonna happen here is, is we're this pizza has about two minutes left till it's about done. So my Pete, brother's sitting the there. Other yeah, I didn't realize I was still sitting there. <laughs> I didn't either. I, I didn't, didn't know. What I didn't I realize. Watching. I thought. I thought he put it up. He's Chef Maxwell, too. I don't know if y'all like Cooking the Instagram it up. live, but... Oh! Hold on, hold on. I'm going to do this right now. I'm going to do this right now. I forgot <laughs> to put this on my story that it was podcast time. I forgot to put this, dude. I don't want... Are that you makes me this? mad. Yeah. Really? All right. We're in the middle of a podcast. just want to say it. We're recording a podcast right now. I'm here with Gage. What's going on? Gage. Hey. And then Jack's down there making a pizza with his long leg looking ass. Two minutes left. But podcast goes up Friday. Make sure to watch it. All right, that's all we need to do. All right, I'll put that on later. This podcast is so bad. You know, I told you this, but someone said that my podcast was terrible. The topics were terrible. Yeah, you told me. No, no, my they're thing, not, My thing is, is that if you if you don't like us, you can't relate to what we're talking about, then you're going to think it's bad. Yeah. Like, if, you, if you're if you into computers and you go and see a sports podcast, you're not going to like a sports no. podcast. You're not into sports. 
So you're going to be like, those topics are bad. Yeah, because that's what they talk about. If you watch us and don't like us. But uh, then again, we don't really have like a sub, like. We don't have any set topics, but like. No, I'm talking about like, we don't have a subject. Like, we're not a technology podcast. We're not a sports well, we podcast. Got we're, just like, we're just a. We're just like, we're just in the, we're just two in the guys pot. sitting and we're talking. We're in the pot. Yeah. In the mosh pit. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what I did there. No, but there's no way he doesn't like any of it. You know? And he's like, you're At this point, he's, he's just a hater. Shit. And I was like, why? He's just a hater. Like, the topics are point. terrible. I'm like, Whatever. Good for you. Like, oh, let, let's see you I make it I said, one. I don't care. Do you have a podcast? Mm. Let's see you make a better one. I'm just <laughs> No, you don't. You don't. All right, I don't want to hear it. I mean, we can still improve, but like, yeah, of course, we're only like but... four episodes in, four or five episodes yeah. in. You know that I've done one every single week? We're on a streak right now. Yeah. We're going like... to two times a week. Two times a week? That'd be rough. That would be rough. That would be rough. It's my bedtime right now. Yeah, guys, tell me why I've gone to bed at 9 and 10 the past three nights. Yeah, the past three nights. Up, dude. I look fat. <laughs> I look fat. I keep going. I've gone to bed at 9 or 10 the past three nights. I've been taking melatonin or whatever. Yeah. Are we going to pause the podcast right here? Let him get the pizza out. Unpause. We're Welcome back. back guys. Welcome back to the podcast. We got here. pizza. Um, excuse us. While we're slurping up our pizzas. We were on the topic of sleep and going to bed really early. Yeah, so. Don't do it, okay? No. Don't do it. I take melatonin or whatever, so I'm out. But I'm so used to staying up late and getting up kind of late. Jack, can you give me a nap? Because I don't have a first period, so I get to wake up an hour later than everybody else. No, but. um, But. I've been waking up at because you're on routine. I know, but I've been waking up at four and five in the morning. So, if you can get over waking up in the middle of the night multiple nights in a row, multiple nights in a row, go ahead and do it. <laughs> multiple nights in a row. Gosh, <laughs> but like, if you can get over that, go ahead and go to bed early. Like, more power to you. It's great. You feel way better. No. <sighs> go ahead. Go ahead. No, what I do you feel got like to it's say? so huh? good. But at the same time, it's so hard as a teenager. Mm-hmm. It's so hard as a teenager. You come home, you go to, all right, you come home. All right, first, let's go back to our routine <laughs> before I start spitting out stupid stuff. You wake up. It's 7 o'clock. Good morning. 7 o'clock. Good luck tomorrow. Night, dude. What time you play? Everybody be there. 6 o'clock, Orangeboro High School. I hope it's tomorrow. Friday. Oh. Hopefully they win. Wishing luck. You won't sit. He's playing somewhere Saturday, so you guys can... Where's your for Saturday? So, um, you wake up, 7 o'clock, right? Good morning. Wake up, take a shower first, because, you know, that's the first thing you do. First, I you first. Take a pee, take a pee. Take a pee. Oh, uh, you're right, you're right. Take a pee, take a shower, you know, go through your morning routine. Mm-hmm. Go to school. Show up at 8.15. Go out your crappy school day. You're there till, what, 3.15? Yep. Go home. That's 3... 25, 3.30. You have about 10, 15 minutes before you have to drive to work. All right. <laughs> you go to work. It's either 4 to 8 or 4 to 9, something like that. 4 to 10 if you're me. 5 to 10 if you're me. All right, let's say let's say 5 to 10. Let's just say 4 to 9 because you can be 4 to 9. Four. You have an hour of free time before you have to go to bed. There's no free time in that. I know. Or. <coughs> you bro, good? That's, that's not. Or, no, 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 you don't get an hour of free time because, all right, so you go from bed to 10 to 6, all right? You have two, about an hour and a half of free time. So you have two and a half hours in your day of free time. Going to bed before 11. That's the goal. That's early bedtime. Yeah. That's before more realistic. 11. That's more realistic. Yeah, before 11. It's not happening tonight. But it's okay. It, I feel like it's better to go in the gym in the morning. Mm-hmm. It is. It is better to go. See, that's in the one plus thing about going to bed early and waking up early. You can do the things you do in the afternoon before school, like going to the gym. And after, you, hold up. And after you go to the gym in the morning, you feel better throughout the day, anyways. For you, having going to work from four to nine isn't an issue every day, because you only work three days a week. Oh, no, it's not an issue anymore, but it was. It was bad. I work five days a week. It's a struggle. But, hey. 
God, I'm gonna get that money. Gotta grind. Sounds really like cliche. Yeah, cliche, but like it is true. I was talking I to feel that. I'm talking about one of my supervisors. Who can his bank account? He's like saw two hundred dollars. He's like, oh my gosh, I have two hundred dollars to spend. I was like, what? <laughs> he's like, that's a lot for me. Two hundred dollars is a lot as an adult. I'm like, is adulting hard? He's like, yes. It's like hell yes. It is hits you right in the face. I'm like, dang. Well, I better get be getting that money now. I'm an adult. I'm moving out, mm-hmm. and I'm not gonna be broke. Mm-hmm. The goal is, by the time I get out of college, I'm gonna be financially stable. No, that's not a word. Um, not financially stable, but not broke. I got you. Know what I'm mm. saying. Topic. Topic. Hot topic. Hot know. topic. Like we may close. have already talked about this. Ah, uh, good one. Great, great, great. Yeah. Um. All right. When I get older. I don't want to buy anything using like I don't want to get a loan for anything. I want to buy everything all cash. You talked about this. No, did I? We didn't talk about all cash, but you said I just want to. I don't think you talked about this on the podcast. Yeah, talk about in my car. Yeah, how you want? Yeah, because I remember it was in my car because you were in my seat. I'm my seat, but in the passenger seat. Go ahead and say that. Go ahead and explain that. Well, then hold up, hold up, hold up. This is really good. What brand is this? DiGiorno. Shout out to DiGiorno. I get that Tostinos. Yeah. Oh, that poor life. Sponsor it. Mm-hmm. Anyways, when I get older, like, I don't know if this is realistic because I'm not an adult and I don't know how all this works, but after college, I want to be able to save up enough money or invest and gain enough money to where I can buy a house and a car in cash, no loan, like no credit whatsoever. It's a lot cash. of paper chasing. Cash. It's a lot of paper chasing there, dude. Cash. A good house or like, like it's a livable house. Three hundred k, okay. Not a house, not for a house, just total. Because I don't think I want to live here. No. And you know how like it is, like in bigger cities. I don't want to live in a big city, but <coughs> I don't want to live in Orangeville. So I was watching. The, all right. So one, that's gonna be difficult. But no, two, I know. It's possible, though. It's possible. But you got to get something popping off. Mm-hmm. I'm saying, mm-hmm. I'm saying mm-hmm. popping off. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Blow up. Popping off. Blow, blow up. I have one. No, I don't know. I always think that, like, everyone had not everyone, but, like, if you're a good enough content creator, you'll have at least one viral video. Not viral, but, like, way up there. Out of, in your numbers. That stands up. Yeah. You do. No, no, you do. Which one? Don't you have one over a thousand? Mm-mm. What do you do? None of my content is good. That's yeah, right. None of my content. This is, is solid quality. podcast right here. This it's is nice. solid. This is a top five podcast. No, it's not. Yes, it is. The reason it's not top five is because because you doubt no, yourself. No, because no one self doubt is your no. worst enemy. All right, I'm, yes, in, I'm in entrepreneurship right now as a class, and there's a thing called smart rules, right? S M A R T. So you have none. <laughs> Specific. <laughs> what does R stand for? Wait, no, we're not on R yet. We're on M. <laughs> measurable. <laughs> measurable. We're on measurable, all right? First, you have to learn how to spell. So, hey, measurable, man. attainable, realistic, and timely. Attainable and realistic is the same flipping thing. So is measurable and <laughs> achievable. But, you know. The book that she's she, that she's literally giving it to us and not smart, teaching. Max. I, I said M and A. I said M and A. I said measurable and attainable. You said achievable. No, I didn't. I said measurable. <laughs> no. Swear to God. Something like that. Something like that. Attainable, achievable. I don't know. They're the same word. But anyways, I gotta be specific with my YouTube channel, right? I gotta I gotta say, all right, listen. I want to be here. In this amount of time, that's your time thing too, right? What's realistic? Thousand subs by the end in a year, that's realistic. But I have to put out good content. But see, the issue is I that first thousand is the hardest. After that, it's exponential. I've noticed that. That's how it works. Once you get like a base following, then it you're just good. grows. It's yeah. solid, and especially if you're consistent with your uploads. 
Well, my thing is, is that one, it has to be consistent. Two, I wouldn't say quality, but like they have to be deep. Like some people have to enjoy watching them. As far as video ideas, go. yeah. No, but like right now, all I got going for me is a mosh pit and um, a gaming video. Every is it Wednesday? Mm -hmm. Thank God. No, it's no. Wednesday. I have to upload a video tomorrow. I have to edit and make a video tomorrow. Shoot. Okay. It's gonna be hard, but um, I have to upload a. I have a gaming video and a mosh pit every single week, and I want to be able to vlog and upload a vlog on Mondays. That'd be cool. You don't have a camera though, do you? That's the issue. I gotta save up for one. Yeah. And I told myself. And you need money to start off too. I told myself. To good I was like, listen, if you're continually uploading up until like the summertime or whenever you get a break, I'll let you buy a vlog camera. I'll let you vlog. That's why I told myself. But if like, I don't want to spend money on a camera just to not use it. Mm -hmm. Like that'd be stupid. So like, like all these white girls. Yes. What is up with that? Every single white girl has a camera to take Instagram pictures with. Like your Instagram isn't going anywhere. You're not gonna make money from it. Why are you? Like if it's your mom cam or your mom's camera or your dad's cool. camera or something. Cool. Cool. Awesome. But if you're out here buying a camera, why? <laughs> why? Why? I'm not gonna say that name out loud. They probably heard it whispering. But um, we. I just don't understand. Like your Instagram isn't going anywhere. Mm, nowhere. Half these people in high school aren't going anywhere. You realize that? Nowhere. You realize that? I know. It's Half crazy. these people aren't going to be successful. Mm -mm. I don't want to say not be successful. No, they're not going to be successful. You're right. God, bro. Every single podcast, you're nuts. I just want you to know that. Thank you. <laughs> but like, with, does that mean the schools are failing us? No. Or does that mean we're failing ourselves? Yes. You think so? Yeah. <coughs> I feel like... If I wasn't, like, smart, like, going into high school, I'd be a failure. Because I have no drive to do anything in school. Yeah. That's the truth. I think that's the biggest thing in high school is just motivation. That's the biggest like, thing today. You Nobody has no, drive. You don't understand. Like, my dad was like, Max, you got to get good grades all like, like throughout elementary school. Third grade or fourth grade was the last year that I got all A's. For real? Yeah. And then I was like, damn, that sucks. And then my dad in my middle school years, he's like, Max, you can't get those. You got to get those B's up to A's. I'm like, dad, it doesn't matter. And now I'm looking back and I'm like, holy wow, crap, Wow, and this matters. Yeah, I'm like, holy cow. <laughs> like, you don't realize how much. But we're, we still don't do anything to make it better. Yeah, you know exactly. what I mean? We just like, like, You don't realize dang. school matters dang. until it's too late. <laughs> right. And once it's right. too late, there's no you're a senior. Back. Yeah. And once you're a senior, all you got going for you is Kroger right down the street. <laughs> right now, that's where I'm headed. That's exactly where I'm headed. Because oh, I don't have much going for me. No, you're good. You're good. No, Grace was like, I was like, oh, no, whenever she switched to the PowerPoint, she's like, I'll listen to you, Max, get your life all together. I'm like, I don't know if that's, like, serious or you're being smart with me. I'm right. like, I mean, I said, I mean, you can do the book if you want to. Like, I'm not telling you to change. She's like, no, you have your life more together than I do. You know what? You right. You right. <laughs> Let's think about this. I was like, hmm. So you have all these clubs, all of these different things that you do on a day to day basis. What do I do? <laughs> what do I do? No, but the thing. But then is... we look at it and say, who's stress free? Who's the guy who doesn't have much stress in his life? That's me. That's me. Bingo. But the thing is, like, all the most, I, I wouldn't even say successful, but, like, all the top students seen by the school, I guess, in the school's eyes, they're all in clubs and way too caught up in the school activities. Like, they have no life outside of school. I mean, they do, but it's usually doing something for the school. You know what I mean? Well, those people don't. They just, they all hang out together. But yeah, but they're all in clubs and stuff. How, yeah. So, I mean, if you enjoy your club, all the power to you. I you don't know. even have time to do any of that stuff now. Neither though. do I. I just, like... I, just, I got stuff to pay for, Max. Oh, no, my, my dad was like, Max, you gotta join a club. Be like, you know... It's gonna be I can't. Awesome. I'm like, first off, there's not a single club that I'd be even halfway interested in. Mm -hmm. Second off... If I want a car, I know I'm going to have to pay for it. So don't even tell me I need a club. 
Cause I'm gonna need a job. And I don't know, dude. That's the go. Since everybody wants to make fun of my car, I'm gonna have a not a new car, but I'm gonna have Family. a I'm gonna have a nice car going a into GTR. college. Going into college. Like a forty thousand dollar car. No, no, nothing that 20, crazy. 000? No, I mean like a two thousand ten or newer. Oh, I see. Like a good car that's gonna last until I can get that forty fifty thousand dollar car I want. Until I can get that Porsche. I was watching saying? a stream. It's gonna be my first big purchase. A car? No, a Porsche. A Porsche? Yeah. I'm going to start with a with crappy Porsche. car. What Porsche? Crappy car, crappy apartment, and I'm going to get a Porsche. A Porsche. What? What Porsche? The fucking, what is it? Uh, Carrera, I think. Didn't you say you want to be an accountant? Yeah. You and now? Yeah. You want to start your own firm? Yep, we That's, are. We Haley, are. Haley told me that. That's the goal. That's Haley the goal. <laughs> I was like, huh, no, I, I just want to do something with finance, anything finance. I want to do something business, computer, or esports. Something like you that. You could do. Or entertaining. Yeah, you could be like a commentator or something. No, that's weak. I'm a terrible commentator. Do you hear how much I stutter? Can't get a single sentence. But you'll get better at it. You know what this has helped me with, though? Speaking. Public yes. Speaking. Like, I can talk. I can't talk. I What am I talking no, about? I slur like, my words all the time. I can't talk at all. But, like, I can keep a conversation going at this point. Yeah, exactly. That's one thing that I like this podcast for is because, like, you have to be talking. Right. For a straight hour. Uh-huh. You have to be popping off, thinking. Your head <laughs> has to be going. Your, head's, your gears are moving. Your head is spinning. Like, a lot of people couldn't do this. Like, the kid that ripped us? I bet he couldn't do it. Oh, no, he couldn't no. do it. He can't even There's talk no doubt at he school. Do it. No. Connor, you know who you are. Yeah, you know. Watch this. He probably won't watch it. No, I know he won't. And he won't get this far if he does. You know, Sammy didn't hit me back on my episode, so I'm assuming like she just, you know, after I talked shit about her, she was like, yeah, that's probably what's going to be. <laughs> talk shit about Sammy. <laughs> so she did, so she did, I'm, I'm assuming, because I don't talk to her, that she didn't watch the last one, or she didn't make it to the point. You know what? This podcast does, too, have, like, a topic... It's just high school. Yeah, it's like... It's just high school. High school, high school students. Minds. High school students. High school students. That's high basically what it is. High school struggles. It's high school Twitter. Yeah. It's basically our Twitter. It's basically high school. Yeah, you're right. It's high school. So don't tell me this doesn't have a topic. No, I mean, like, it's not, like, focused on anything. Oh, uh, yeah. But, like, it's two high schoolers, so you can... Bet your butt what we're gonna talk about. <laughs> <laughs> like, we're gonna talk about rappers. We're gonna talk about clothing. We're talking about making money. We talk about jobs. We're gonna go into some spacey stuff. Dumb kids that go to school with. I'm telling you, I'm making that jean jacket, dude. This kid wants to paint a Rick and Morty. No, I have a logo friend, on the have, back no, no, of a logo, denim jean the jacket. Tell me that wouldn't be dope. He thinks he can paint it though. That's the thing. No, he doesn't okay. realize how hard it's going to be to paint. Okay, but it's a guy, lot harder than you think. Like, this kid doesn't realize is that you can literally draw an outline on the whole thing. But you, all you're still lines. not going to be able to paint it like the way you need need it to look. What do you mean? It's not going to be detailed like you want it to. It's going to look stupid. You're not going to get the right colors either. You know how weird and abstract those colors are. Green. Blue, it's not green white, though. It's like black. It's like a like a slime green color. Okay, all right. So what we're gonna do? I'm gonna take our little green here, go mix it in with our white, and we're gonna make slime green. You think so? You think I think easy? so. I'm pretty sure I took art. Oh, okay. I'm pretty right, sure I Pablo took art. Picasso. All right. Man's is nutty. All right, all right Picasso. Is... Are you serious? <laughs> Gosh, give me that one too. No, just go get your own. No. No, but like, what's that saying? Mm. Look, you can't even keep up. Come on, Jean Mr. Jacket. Host. Gosh. That's how freaking fast my brain works, bro. I forget oh, what I'm about so? to say. <laughs> I know so. No, but like... Okay, even if I can't... Do... No way. It skipped 11. Oh, we must have been getting pizza. That's 15. It's 11... Oh, that says it's 11.15. Yeah. Jean jacket, come on. So even if I can't do the Rick and Morty, I could still paint something on it. It would be hard. Yeah, you can paint something. You're not going to paint that logo on there. I want you, all right. Wait, how? What do you mean? You know how deep that is? I want you to look up Jean Jacket. 
Yeah, I do outlines. You could do little pencils. You can get white, like slur, you know. But it's gonna I look it. tacky like that. So what if I didn't do the green circle? What if I just did Rick and Morty? Do that dope looking S. You know that all kids know how to do. No, the, that's the so three bad. lines. The, the three way. lines. The the uh, the ones that we drew in like elementary school. Yeah. And then you, no. U P R E. M- Super- e- Supreme? Yes, but They should do a logo like that. Look, yeah, yeah their it'd be dope. It'd be dope. No, but like, okay, let's say I didn't do the green circle. Let's put Rick and Morty on there. You're right? not going to be dope. able to. It's not going to look good because it's too deep. All right, I want you to go, to, I want you to Google, do it yourself. You're not going to get that blue either. I want you to, You're not going to get that blue, blue either. What blue? R- uh, the Rick's hair. You realize that they have so many different paint colors, right? Have you ever been to Lowe's, Home Depot, Walmart? You look at paint, you're like, oh my god, there is so I many have been there. different colors. Yeah. This is retarded. Why is there I've so many it. different colors yeah. of blue? Uh-huh. Like, wh- yeah. you don't need this many blues. Mm-hmm. Well, guess what? You That's might my, need that many my blues. My name is Maxwell, and I think I can paint Rick and Morty on the back of a denim jean jacket. She told me if I pulled it off, if I end up doing it, you wouldn't, you'd be like, you... It'd be dope, but I give you props for it, but it's not going to happen. Like, Bet. Apple logo on the back of a denim jean Bet. jacket? Possible. Bet. Rick and Morty logo? Possible! That would be so easy! You literally take a freaking stencil. You, uh, you trace it. I just spit all over you. <laughs> I don't care, because I... This is insane. You, alright, you... This is a cookie cutter right here, okay? I say, alright, I'm going to make a cookie out of my hand. So I'm going to cut a really bad circle, because I don't have a stencil. Bam! I have a freaking circle cutter here. Stick it on there and cut a circle out. It's that easy. It's not hard. You literally draw. You literally draw an outline. The and thing it, is, and you if don't it looks bad, how hard you it's don't be to have paint to it. paint it. You don't have to paint it. You can redo it if it looks that bad. I've already looked up YouTube videos on how to do it. It's not that hard. All right, let's see it. Let's see you order your what? $24 jean jacket 20, and ruin it. First off, ruin it. It's only $24. You know how much a normal jean jacket goes for? You know how much $24 could get you? Not much. Almost a full tank of gas, Max. Almost a full tank I of gas. I already budget my gas. <laughs> Big brains up here, dude. I already know what I'm doing. That could be $24 towards your vlogging camera that they will much... They would much rather it have It would take me three vlog. weeks. It would take me three weeks to get a vlogging camera. Four. Maybe five. A month and a week. Not that difficult. You think so? Not that difficult. You think so? But I'm in debt, so I can't do that. Exactly. I'll be out in I'll be out of debt in ten weeks. Ten weeks where will we be? That's four, two, two and, and a half, half months. Month. April or May. If I'm still grinding videos by April or May, oh, we're still in January, not February. I was thinking we're in February. Dang. It'll be the end of March, early April. It'll be spring break when you're out of the- Early April? So I better order it soon. No! I don't have to save up that much money. Because if we think about it, I only need seventeen fifty instead of 2100 This kid's talking numbers, ignoring. Sort of God. He's ranting about his budget. Sort of God. Again. I'm not going to check my bank account right now. No, you're not. <laughs> I was no, about you're to, not. I was about to do finances in my head right now, dude. Why does this kid have an Apollo strength long sleeve shirt on? Because well, you don't even have weightlifting glasses. I did have weightlifting glasses. Not anymore. Does when that was the matter? the time you went to the gym, Max? It's a joke. I didn't mean that. Sunday. Mean that. Sunday. Mean... Sunday. Did you go with me Sunday? No. Went and shot ball at a gym. In a gym. Oh, an actual I called them an actual in gym. In a gymnasium, wow. <laughs> a gymnasium, bro. Yeah, because you got ripped on. Yeah, yeah, this kid got ripped on by so a So I'm at the gym. Student. All right, so I go to Brescia uh, to ball up sometimes, and I walk in there, and the door's locked, and I'm like, what the heck? There's a girl and a boy playing basketball. I'm like, all right, so obviously they've been fluffing in here, right? The <laughs> doors are locked. What else would they be doing? And the lights are, half the lights are off, so I'm like, oh, oh they, got, really? they got real moody in here. So, we knock on the door, and they open it up, and it's a black guy, of course, and his mixed uh, ting, and we go over to the other side, and we start shooting ball, and we're just, you know, my kids just having fun, playing ball, and he yells, you suck! I'm like, what? I'm like, wait, what did you I'm say? like, no. I'm like, did I actually just hear that, or 
Am I tripping? Like, there's no way he just yelled, you suck, to a random kid, right. random white dude uh-huh. playing basketball. And he goes, you guys blow. I'm like, I'm like, okay. So, of course, he's talking mm-hmm. trash. I'm like, yeah, we know. That's why we're here. He starts laughing. I'm like, yeah, keep laughing, dude. Keep <laughs> swishing your threes. I'll keep bank- banking my threes, and I'll get better. And I'm like, I'm not even in college. Right. I'm not even in college. I'm not playing ball. This for- kid's not on the team either. I'm not even D3. Yeah, exactly. You're not even D3. Yeah, You're you- D4 or 5. <laughs> I bet you don't play ball. Like, shut up. I bet you sit the bench because I've never heard your name. Don't don't talk to me. <laughs> I bet I could pull his face up right now on Brescia. Oh, I didn't get that no, look. Probably not on the team. That's the thing. Yeah. He was probably just. And then his friend around. pulled up and they played one v one. Was it good? I don't know. I wasn't watching. I was one v one and Jack. Mm. See, this one thing that makes me so mad. One v one and Jack <laughs> makes me so mad. It's got like two uh, feet on me. I even like try. I even try to go this. Like his hand is right here, and then the ball <laughs> just smacks his hand. You pump fake, try to get in. I literally room. pump fake. Nothing. He goes, Bink. <laughs> he goes, literally just bends over more and goes back to the stance he's in. I'm like, I can't do anything if I stop dribbling. <laughs> we need to try out next year. No, yes. I'm not trying out for the we'll basketball the team. Only two, well, three seniors, and I'm not sitting on the bench. So. Why you tell not? you know how embarrassing that would be. Who cares about embarrassing? I don't have time. You know how much fun that would be. How are you gonna get your Porsche if you're playing basketball on what the bench? What do you mean, bro? How are you gonna get your I'm Porsche if you're sitting on the bench? I'm about to have a breakout season. <laughs> yeah, right. Just completely <laughs> forget about Memphis All and right, football. No, no, seriously, senior year. Bowling. No. Tennis. Senior year, guys. Golf. Okay, I don't know if y'all are graduated or what, but okay, in your senior year. Should you do as much as you can? No. No? Should you be like that normal senior that doesn't wants to do the bare minimum? No. Then what do you do? You go to work and you get your money. You just do that happy medium? All right, you have to think about this. Your senior year, like right now, we should have enough credits to graduate. Basically, right? No, not yet. We're basically there. Basically. You need one or two credits to right. graduate. That literally takes like what? Another reading and a math and then like. Yeah, exactly. That's two classes out of six. Three classes out of six. You have three periods to do whatever the fluff you want to. And mine's going to be yoga. Let's rethink this, right? You should take yoga with me. Yoga is you know the boys had to sit in the front of the class? Do they really? <laughs> yeah. That's wow. You know why? I know exactly. Well, actually, I don't, but... You don't? I mean... You just want me to say it. No, no, no. Is it, like, because of a specific person, or is it because, you know, it's yoga and... Because of girls' yoga butts. Pants. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they don't say their butts. <laughs> be prime time, though. <laughs> what? It be was, prime what? time to it go was, ham, was, you know what I'm saying? No. No baloney, no. No, no. no, but, okay, okay. Should you just meet in the middle? Or should you do, like, everything you can? Like, join all these clubs, all these sports teams, like, just if go you, all, all right. out. No, if you do, no, 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 no. So if I'm a college, I don't know what they think. I don't know how they think. I don't know. I don't know what they're thinking. And I'm like, all right, Gage, let's see, let's see what you've done here. So you did football, freshman, sophomore, junior. Senior year, you did basketball, golf. <laughs> Football, football, baseball, baseball, tennis. tennis. Don't forget bowling. You were in dance blue. And you were on the archery team? Wow. Arch- <laughs> How did you juggle all this? You say, I said the bench. <laughs> what? A- we're signing you right now. No, that's not what they're thinking. They're like, okay, this kid obviously didn't do anything his, his other years. Is- I've never thought of it like that. Twice. I've only thought of it like the, wow, this kid is actually trying to get better. I've never thought of it like, wow, this kid was lazy his first three years of high school. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. That's so like, true. You might as well just make it four years. That's so true. It's not like, and if you get a, a mm, I don't know how they look for, um, because like, I don't want to say I have a full, I don't have a full ride, but like, I'm basically going to Brescia. Mm-hmm. So, I don't know how it is with football. Like, do you have to do other stuff, like other those curricular activities? Not really. I mean, or well, is it just good grades in football? The top, well, see, I'm not gonna get offered. I mean, I might get offered in football, but it's not gonna be a four out or anything. It's not gonna be what I like need. Mm. But for like the top athletes, as long as they maintain like a two point five GPA in high school, 
and then show up, like, and then do good in their sport, and they're set. But that's just for, like, the top Division One athletes. That's Division One. Yeah, that's, like, top Division One athletes. That'd be... And in college, all they got to do is maintain a 2.5, too. No, uh mm-hmm. For real? Mm-hmm. So how are these college kids? Well, most of them don't, like... The best the don't. Bench. Yeah. Yeah. So I was watching the stream. I was going to go back. I was going to talk about this, and I think the piece of thing happened. But um, I was watching the stream... I noticed that he lives in a streaming house, bro. Oh. So he's got his best friend. He all right. So he, dude, I want to do that. In on a college, house with like four or five dudes. Like me, you, and Noah, all in a house. Brett, what what uh, thing is Brett in? Oh. What grade is Brett in? He's a, a senior. Creamer? He's a senior. Noah's friend, hockey friend. No, 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 no. Brett O'Connor. Oh, he's a freshman in college. Oh, he is. Yeah, he goes oh, to Cornell. Dang. He's a smart kid. Oh. He's rich too. Is he really? He's loaded. So he's already set for life. Well, I think he's loaded. I don't really he's know. He's halfway loaded. Did you see him? Yeah, I already told you about that. He got called up by Pomarosh. Mm hmm. Yeah. Elite. No, but, um, I just, one, like, that'd be so good for content. Like, this is, my brain would be like, okay, you have people, you have content, you have healthy living in terms of, like, it's cheaper. Depending on where you go, how you do it. The thing is about the, like the best. Content, it's the location that's the issue. Location, base following, and then like base following. What do you mean? Well, no, like all right, you don't see. I don't know if it's just because like people haven't discovered them, but like you see the phase house, you see optic house. They're all together. They're popping, making content. But is there anyone else that like moves in with each other and tries to start from there? Cause if you started with the whole the group, clout house <laughs> or whatever. Well, no, it was. That, they already they already yeah. had a following. Like, I'm saying if you don't have a following, oh, if you yeah. have like a hundred, two hundred subscribers, a thousand oh, and subscribers, then you move in, and to then you grow? move in, and you move in to grow, and you just like That'd one, you you move in with your best friends, two, you like do content, three, it's in a good location, so there's more content you can do. Like, you could grow out of that. The thing is about that, like if you're small, it's so hard to do that though. Because you have outside factors. Like, well, you actually have to work a job. I mean, yeah. this could be a job for some people. Yeah, but, like... But until but that But doing point, a 9 to 5, and then come home, and all your dudes play games together... Be lit. That'd be fun. It's just the location, that's the issue. Like... I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing if I don't go to brush it, besides just work. I don't know what I'm doing. Like, I know what I'm doing. I just don't know where. Move my foot. I have no here. idea where I'm going after high school. No, I'm moving it back. You can put your feet back. You know? No idea where I'm going after high school. I know what I'm doing. I just don't know where I'm going. You have to have, yeah, you have to have a college education for accounting. I mean. If you start going for I could work at U.S. Bank as soon as I graduate, for real. No. uh I mean, I don't know if somebody could put me on, but I'm sure I could find enough people to get me put on there, mm-hmm. and I could just work my way up. Is is that what that is? U.S. Bank a union or no? I'm not sure. No. You mean work your way up? Because if they're a union, then you're gonna have to be there till you're like eighty. <laughs> <laughs> but if you're out there grinding, you know, selling home loans, you're set. No, I don't. Even, I don't even know what job I want to do, dude. That's an issue. See, I know what I want to do. I just don't know where. You know where you want to go. You just don't know what you want to do. Like, I want to get a. Um, That's what I wish school teach to you. Well, taught like you. What you want to do? Like, what to do outside of school? That would help a lot. That would help a whole lot. Help a whole lot. And as, as far as like the college stuff goes, they don't teach you none of that. Summer, I want to do like, I don't know, I can't really just quit working. But I get less right. hours. But um, I can't just not go to football practice. Just like, <laughs> or a paid internship or an internship somewhere just to see like, or job shadowing or something. Like, go to some computer place. Oh, that'd be cool for real. Or, I don't know. Like, what's a good starting, like, if, are you, would you, are, let me first ask this question. Are you, as soon as you graduate high school, 
and you go to a college or you don't go to college? Are you out of Owens school? I don't know. I don't know. I don't like. That's the thing. I don't know. I have no idea. Cause my my thing. Cause sometimes I want to stay here, then other times I'm like, I want to bounce. Cause my thing is, is that if I go to college here, I get a degree here, I go someplace else. I don't know how far away it'd be, but someplace I'd want to go. I would work a job throughout college. I'd have enough money saved. I could get a rent at some place. Get like. Like See, here, like here, you can literally make thirty thousand dollars and survive in Owensboro. Oh, cake, easy. Single person. Yeah. One bedroom apartment, renting out. That'd cake. be easy. Cake. So, depending on your location, depends on how much you'd make. But like, if we were say here, like let's say you moved to Owensboro, and like out of college, you have to at least be making thirty thousand dollars here. There's no way. There's no way. I feel like there's no jobs in Owensboro. But there's a whole lot of freaking jobs in Owensboro. You just don't realize it because we're still kids and we only look at the, I guess, the dumb job. Like, the rest. I was talking to my dad about this. I was like, why do we get the bottom feeder jobs? He's like, you gotta start somewhere. He's like, well, you gotta work your way up. I don't know. I was like, is it just because you have to, like, work your way up? Like, he's like, I I, I guess. I was like... But I feel like I'm smarter like, than seventy five percent of the people I work with. But are they? Are they, how old are they? I Me. Mean, some of them are grown. Like, see, I feel like grown. if you're if you're grown and you're still working, all right. If you retire and then you come back to work, I understand that. But if you're like, that's your job. I feel like you just went nowhere in life. I could. I wouldn't say that. It's just like. Dang. That, like, that's there's, a, there's a girl named Crystal. She's been working at Kroger for nine years. Not very good looking. She has a uh, a lisp, a bad Did lisp. Did she, like, go straight out of high school? Or I don't know. That's what I'm thinking. She's, like, 20-something, maybe. I'm like, you've been at Kroger for nine years. So you probably got a high, out of high school, and you've been working here since, and that's, like, a long time. And if I, April... That'd be two years. So for I'd, if I'm a senior and I'm still working at Kroger, I'd be working at Kroger for two years. And that would get me, what, 40 cents more? And I'd probably get bumped up more than that. But still, that's like, uh, <laughs> $8 an hour? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm like, there's so many other jobs you could work in Owensboro. To but, make that. Yeah. To get way more than that, but it's just schedules. I don't know, dude. I'm, I don't want to say I'm worried, but, like, it's definitely in the back of my mind. Like, I'm not stressed out about it, but I know it'll work out in the end. I'm not stressed about college because I know I'm set. Pretty much, like, I'm pretty much set on going. I know I'm going, and I know it's not going to be super hard for me to get in. I'm just scared. You're of, just, like... I'm scared after school. Like, I don't know what to do after school. Yeah. Well, you know what ticks me off, though? Mm-hmm. The kids who can take a gap year... Or say they're going to take a gap year and then never go back. Or not even never go back, but, like, since their parents are super wealthy. Or not super wealthy, but they have money. Like, they can just sit around and smooch out their parents until they, like, choose to go. That kind of takes me off. Who did that? What? Who does that? Oh, nobody in particular. You yes, just those people in general. Yeah. Like, I get the like gap I, year. I understand the gap dumb. year, but it's like, at first I was like, man, they're high school, I'm taking a break. Say, it's like, but no, I'm not. I don't have time to take a break. No, I don't no have time, time to take a break. I need money, bro. Like, if you're going to take a break, you, you need to have a job during that break. Uh-huh. And if you have a job, it's going to lead to it's $10 gonna, an hour. You're going to be working 40 hours a week. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, it's not going to be much of a gap year. It's going to be a work full year. of work. Yeah. I mean, you can learn some things in that gap year, in a 40 hour work day year, mm-hmm. but it's going to be a struggle. Well, I don't know. I don't know. I can't think right now. No, but I don't know. I'm not stressed about I'm not stressed out about it. I'm not worried about it. Just like, better find out what I'm going to be doing mm-hmm. the rest of my freaking life. Mm-hmm. I don't want to be like no Miss Morrow jumping from job to job to job to job. Oh, uh, does she? Is that what she's been She's doing? had like four or five jobs. She's been a teacher. That's another thing. At college. four different schools. 
She's been a travel agent or a travel assistant, something like that. She's worked in corporate, and then she did something else. But see, that's good for some people because some people don't want to get like settled down and do one thing their whole life. But like, as far as money goes, that's not the way to go. Mm-hmm. Money go the way money works is like the longer you're there, the more you're making. That makes me mad. Well, that it just takes a long time to get money. Unless you blow up doing something yeah, like this. There's so many people doing this. It's like... To just just like consistent. rap now. Like, yeah, exactly. There's so many people and so many different and then people are blowing up. you look up. at like, what's the next thing that blows up that people get like super popular off of? And it's like, I have no idea. Yeah, you don't know. You like, you don't no know until idea. it happens. Yeah. What, what blew up that like... Rap? No, like... Other than, like, music and entertainment was. Um, what blew up? It's like in our time, that's the only two that's blown up. Really? Like, YouTube kind of popped off. Because YouTube started in, like, 2004, 2007, somewhere around there. And so we were, like, three or f- to five then. Something it started like that. before that, I think. But it didn't really, Maybe like, 2000, I don't know. It didn't get But it, it, it started in the 2000s. Yeah. And then it started getting... People started popping off in like 2012. Now people are blowing now up. Now people, now yeah, now people are blowing, blowing up because they're playing the game of clickbaiting and putting pals. See, I don't want to do that, but like you have to. It's annoying. So YouTube did music, and I then mean, music. Music's always been like that, but it's rap now, especially. Yeah, yeah. Like it's, 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 much easy, it's much SoundCloud, easier. Yeah, for real. it's much easier to get main, not mainstream, but it's much easier to get like blown up, recognized, and yeah. stuff. I mean, going to... what? What else? That's got like SoundCloud is the only thing I can think of. SoundCloud, YouTube. YouTube. I mean, um, the mainstream media has kind of fallen off since those two were blown up. Since the internet, really. Like no one watches. Only people. I don't know much people. I don't know many teenagers that watch TV. Like I go home and I watch. I feel TV. like TV's kind of like falling. Oh, it has no doubt. Like ratings have fell on <clears throat> a lot of things. It's just because like I don't even watch TV. I don't watch much at all anymore. For real, like YouTube, yeah. TV, anything. See, I watch like maybe four or five people when I'm subscribed to a lot of people, but like only watch four or five of them. No, but um. Now everyone, now all these mainstream are coming over to YouTube or something. And it's like, it's like they're getting paid promotions. Mm-hmm. So they're getting put at the top and people click on it. Our freaking camera's falling over. Oh no. When did it start falling? Oh no, am I crooked? Oh no. <laughs> How far are we into this? Uh, an hour and four minutes. What about right. ten to twenty minutes? I'm gonna bounce. Right now, ten. Ten. Okay. Yeah, ten. I'm Hopefully, trying to I'm trying to <laughs> at midnight. All right. Because I'm trying to get that eight hours nice. I'm trying to feel nice and good. I'll wake up at eight forty-five or eight fifteen. Uh huh. I wish I could do that. I wake up at eight thirty and it'd be fun for real. Eight thirty. I wake, wake up at 8.45. Oh, yeah, you don't have to be till like, 9 or something. I can right? wake up at 8.45 and be oh, okay. This is so uncomfortable. 8.45? But I take a shower in the morning. That's, that's a lot of time. Not a lot, but... You know, what's the fastest shower you've ever taken? <laughs> Probably two or three minutes. Oh, it's two minutes. Probably something like... Uh, one song, okay? Yeah, one song. I didn't even... I didn't, we didn't even get to play songs. But that's like... Why why did you have to take a fast shower? You were late? No, nah, because I was going to hang out with people. Oh. They were picking me up. Did you, like, actually take a shower? Yeah, hair and body. That's what I did. I hopped that. in. Shower. <sighs> I had the shampoo in my hand as my hair was getting wet. <laughs> and then as I'm scrubbing my hair, I'm <coughs> grabbing the body wash. No, we were on. Um, I was in Panama City. Yeah, I was at the Panama City Beach with our church, and we were like, church service started at like eight thirty, and it was like eight fifteen. Oh, and everyone had to take showers, oh, so there was like yeah. four or five of us. So like, Carrie, he was the adult for our room. He's like, "All right, guys, get in there, get out." <laughs> and so like a minute, and he's like, "Max, you're almost done." I'm like, 
Yeah, I'm close yeah, to I'm it. Sure. <laughs> close to <laughs> it. <laughs> it was weak. No, but honestly, I probably take like 15 minute showers on average. Yeah. Mine are, okay. mine are pretty lengthy. About three to five I mean, songs. the hot water runs out. Oh, mine run, run out. Uh, mine runs out because I like it hot. And I mean. Like super hot? Hot. Like burning hot? I'm not burning hot. Oh. Like if I have it on my hair, I need to turn it down a little because. Do your feet sometimes, whenever they're cold and then you get in, they sting? I know what you're talking about. My oh, I hate that. that. My hands, my hands on this. My tops like, my if feet. I went outside right now and then came back in and put them under, how, oh, it hurts so bad. My, it's just the top of my feet don't do that. I don't know why. Guess it's changing the temperatures, bro. Oh, oh snap. I hopped on the Sherpa train today, guys. I ordered yeah, a Sherpa. Yeah, I bought a Sherpa. And I'm going to buy a Sherpa when I get out of debt. Well, I'll probably buy a Sherpa. I think Sherpas are so cool. Well, like they're like, oh, only girls wear them. I don't care. Well, no, no, like guys wear them too, but they it, they're that Patagonian brand. No, man. but it's, it's just like, like it's so hard to find a Sherpa for a guy. Get a Patagonia, spend a hundred fifty dollars on one. Like their mom and dad buy. No it, sir, buy Hayden Sheldon. <laughs> no sir, Caleb Fulgerson. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> yes. No sir, that is not happening. I don't have one hundred fifty dollars to drop on an article of clothing. Got three fifty to drop on a pair of shoes, but that's shoes. That's different. That's different. See, that's what people people are like. Oh, so you don't want to spend your money on this, but you'll spend three fifty dollars shoes. I'm like, okay, shoes are different. Shoes are completely different. Shoes they're are like, no, they're not. Different. They're narco clothing. I'm like, you're not wrong, but they're different. You know what I used to do, like mm. elementary, middle school, mm. like before shoes were even that big of a deal. That's the first thing I would look at. Shoes. Yeah, I, when somebody I was like, wow, you know this kid's cool. Yeah, now I, was, I, was, I still I think look in at shoes for seventh for grade. Real. It was around. It was socks. Yeah, yeah. I was that kid that had all of them too. Yeah, socks and shoes. Socks and shoes. Socks I'm and telling shoes. you. Not shoes. No, I did shoes for me. Seventh grade's good. I got a custom pair of Nike Roshi. I just like getting five. stuff that nobody else has at this point. So I want to pin that jean jacket. That's why I just ordered that Sherpa thing. Like, nobody else has that. They have See, that. See, but one thing that's annoying not is that, that me and you, I feel like we kind of like the same clothing. So, like, you'll get something and be like, oh, I wish I had that. But, like, I don't want to cut the see, same thing. See, some of the stuff you have, I wouldn't wear. Like what? Like, uh... The checker... The see, red and black? I like that low-key. Low-key, what is it? Adidas? Your freaking... Your Adidas. The Adidas sweatshirt. Like, I need to get rid of a lot of clothing. I don't really mess with the stuff on the sleeves. Like, I the stuff with. you uh, show me, it's really cool, but I wouldn't wear it. I, I just don't mess with I it. I mess with the stuff on the sleeves, dude. Or, like, just one sleeve. It's really cool. That's I dumb. just don't think I can do it. What about one, What about sleeve tattoos? Like, just one sleeve? No, nah, if you're going to sleeve <laughs> it out, you got to go all out. You think? Yes. I think it low-key looks dope when just one. One? See, I, I would never get a tattoo unless I get a super jack. Not super jack, but like. See, my issue is, yeah, yeah. My issue is, wait, why? Because you got to be big to show off a tattoo. No, you don't. Yeah, but you can't be like me and then get one on your titty or something. No, my uh, my supervisor, Jacob, that I was talking about that adulting, he has a tattoo right here. And then he has two tattoos on his leg. But you don't see the leg ones most of the time because he has to wear pants. But like. He, you gotta be skinny or you gotta be rich. That's something. Last topic, and no, I then I gotta bounce. Like, all these teenagers, especially girls, tattoos. they just want to go out and get a tattoo. I don't get that. I don't get it. If at you all. want a tattoo and wait. it means something, please wait. Wait, why wait? Just wait. Oh, my thing is that like, what if like right now I get a tattoo, right? I get one on my arm right here. I start hitting the gym. I start getting big. What is that tattoo going to do? Right, I, I don't know. That's why I don't like... No, but I don't understand why these 16, 17-year-olds, or 15-year-olds, think tattoos are so cool. Like, I think they're cool because... They're cool if they have meaning, but yeah. if you're getting, I don't know, flipping peace written in Japanese down your spine, like, that's stupid. Like, that's dumb. Or a rose. Or a rose, or, like, flowers down your back. Like, just why? What's the point? Some people like some people are like, oh, 
it just looks cool. I'm like, all right. That's I'll, fine. Just sure. wait until you're grown. Sure, yeah, wait till you're grown. And you know that's what you want. It's kind of like, my thing is, if, you're, if you want a tattoo and you're any age, put that drawing and that piece beside your bed. I wake up every morning looking at that and be mm-hmm. like, okay, dude, do I really want to see this every single mm-hmm. day? Like, I'm not judging or nothing. Yeah, it's yeah, I know what I'm saying. You got to think, like. I guess it's going to be on you for the rest of your life. Uh-huh. Do you really want this on you? And you're going to make this decision at 16 or 17 years old? Like. As a junior in high school? I want, like, a, um, something on my wrist right here. Like, a plus sign or something. Just something simple. Just, like, positive. I don't want nothing. Nothing? No. I either want nothing or I want, not a lot, but, like. I don't want a full sleeve. That's what I realized. I want to live like pretty basic life. Not I like I want to do stuff. And, like, yeah, I know what you're saying. But like go to high school, go to college, go to college, get a job, go to get life, a nice job, get, get a house, a wife, get a car, a couple kids, get a couple kids, like, and just go through. Yeah. At what age do you want? At what age do you think you want kids right now? How many kids? Thirty. 30 kids? Jesus no, not 30 Christ. 30 kids. I want to be 30, I think. Something like that. And how many kids? Because that gives kids? me eight years to do whatever. How many kids? Two. Boy, boy, girl, boy, girl, girl. Not two girls. Girl, boy. As long as I get one boy, I'm good. My um uncle, he, he could have four or five girls right now. But only have three. Because of miscarriage, yeah. That's crazy. They they continue to try for a boy. But the thing is, like, what if I had twins on the first, like, the first time? What if they triplets? Oh, my God. Well, that'd be crazy. Slim. Very slim. It's still, like. That is crazy. It's possible. I know. I don't know, like. Right now, I say that, and then a few years down the road, it might be completely different. I don't even know if I want a wife. Like, girls be tripping, man. <laughs> girls be tripping. Girls be tripping. No, my bro. thing is, I look at... All right, so I'm at Kroger. Brazy. People, Kroger is a good place to people watch. I'm telling you right now. Kroger, because you're bagging, you're in front of everybody. You see everything. You see arguing. You see happy. You oh, see you smiles. see everything. There's this one guy. The lady was pulling his cart, or... It was her husband, and she was pulling it to put the stuff on the thing, and he, she ran over his foot. He, like, bitch at her foot. I'm like, dude, there's, that. There was, he didn't flip out, but he was like, why would you run over my foot? And then she, was, like, was ignoring me, and he, like, got close to her. I'm like, what is the point in doing that? Calm I'm like, down. dude, she didn't mean to. Just <laughs> right. chill out. I'm like, hopefully I'm not like that when I'm freaking, you know, another thing that I'm thinking? Like, I'm not, I'm really not that hard to deal with. Like, I don't think I. Yeah, I, I don't mean, think I am. I but then am. I'm like, okay, but there's a bad side of me that I know if someone gets to, it's like, Jesus Christ, this kid. Like, I'm not mean, but I'm a handful at times. Yes, you exactly. I mean? Yes, I'm a handful Like, I'm like, oh, dude, like, a girl wouldn't have a problem with me. But then, like, there's always problems with everyone. There's always a oh, good side and a dark goodness. side. It's like, once you get to that dark side, it's like, oh. That's, it's just depending on how bad it is. That's why I just don't hit. That's one thing I don't have a ting. I don't have a single ting. I need. I need. Because one, I don't try. Two, I don't talk to girls. I gotta get mine back somehow. It's gonna happen. Wait on it, guys. A year from now. There was that. I don't know, dude. What do you think? Uh, I don't want to go into that topic. Yeah, I gotta bounce. Save it for next time, anyways. I gotta bounce. (laughs) We can go. We get so much more on this. Oh, we do. I just said like. We'll video. cut that out, right? Yeah, <laughs> we'll, cut that out. we'll cut that out. We'll cut that out. Like, what are you saying? Oh, oh, baby, no money. Honeymoon with your bitch out in Nantucket. 30 racks down like fuck it. Hey, gravy might splash like a bucket. Hit a home run.